Master Mewtwo coming to you with episode number four of the Moemon Fire Red Randomizer Nuzlocke grinding montages or the uh, the post game show I'll say but basically if you've been watching the grinding montages especially with the last one boo anyway um, we're in Cerulean City. We couldn't catch anything getting out of Mount Moon because that was still part of Route 4, so can't do anything there. After Nugget Bridge, I'll be able to catch Pokemon again. And hopefully I'll catch something because we lost something that leveled up pretty quickly but then slowed right down. And you'll see when I show you the team update. So, I got them all up to level 20, which was no big thing. It was like only two or three levels each. We got Gil, the Sveal. I don't know when he evolves. I don't remember. But anyway, we got... We're rocking Powder Snow, Water Gun, Ice Ball, Body Slam. Learned Body Slam last last episode. Rango, the Kecleon, Modest Nature. Whoop, wrong way. Yeah, only Sassy, so no real boost there. But we got the Modest Natured Rango with the color change with that amazing special defense and great attack great physical attack so it only makes sense that I taught Rango rolling kick mega punch was rolling kick and mega kick was wing attack if you remember from the last episode faint attack side beam roll, rolling kick and scratch scorch of the Charizard yes be jealous speed of 50 which is great meaning nothing's gonna outspeed me too often careful nature which isn't much good Scratch, Wing Attack, Ember, Metal, Claw. Two stab moves, I love it. Kirby. Uh, the Calm, Gulpin Kirby with the Starf Berry. Rocking that Liquid Ooze. And Pound, Yawns, Poison Gas, and Sludge. Anyway, um... I don't remember what the rival's gonna be like. Let me just check my experience... Rates here, six, nine, four, nine, three, nine. okay, that's fine. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go after the rival. Beginning of Nugget Bridge, let's see how well I do. We got one Z, yo James, you still struggling along back here, I'm doing great. Ah, caught a bunch of strong and smart Pokemon here, let me see what you caught James. Okay. I don't know why I put a western drawl or southern drawl onto it, but whatever. Starting off with the A Palm at level 17. I am over leveled. I like that. So let's start with the Ice Ball. Start raining some hell down on this team. Oh wow. Ice Ball did nothing. Nothing. Okay, second Ice Ball takes out the half, more than a half. Well, just about a half. Yeah, I keep scratching me. I'm hanging on. There. Third ice ball. There goes a palm. Hopefully that shell belt brings me up at least four or five. One. Thanks, shell belt. Maku shit. I... Oh. Oh my god, I got so lucky there. So lucky, you wouldn't believe. Let's see what else once he's got. Corefish. So this won't do as much as fifth ice ball. But Corefish is where ga oh ha. Corefish is what Abra should have been. And the next should be Vigoroth, I'm thinking. Yeah. Yeah, level twenty one. Rocking it, rocking it, rocking it. There's Vigoroth again, so I'm actually going to switch out to Rango. Because Rango's got that almighty rolling kick. Oh, uproar. Ooh, wow. Okay, I can take another uproar. As long as it's not a crit, so I'll go for the rolling kick here. And then heal, rolling kick, heal. I missed the rolling kick. And Vigoroth calmed down, but that's not helping me at all. Oh, what do I have? What do I have? What do I have? Heal powders. Okay, looks like I'm using one of my hyper potions. <laughs> That's okay. 
scratch. Okay. Let's go for that rolling kick. It. There's the uproar again. Come on. Come on, Rango. Bang. Oh, no. Not not enough. So I'm going to slap on the hyper potion. Uh, not the hyper potion, but the regular potion. This should keep me alive. Ooh. ooh, ooh. Um, ah, to hell with it. If I had super potions, that would have been a little more bang for the buck. Okay, I can live another one, so I'm going to go for the rolling kick. Uh, should I have gone for the rolling kick, though? Okay, it hit. That's what I was afraid of. Yeah, Rango. That was scary. That uproar is going to just curse me forever. I went to Bills and got him a shot. Forget it, I skipped ahead too far already. So, I have implemented questions of the day. So today's question of the day is once he does his march off the screen and comes back with the frickin' versus recorder. Fame checker versus recorder, same damn thing. But basically, Halloween's coming around. What is your favorite Halloween costume? It can be something you've worn to a Halloween party. It can be something you've worn out for Halloween. Um, for me... I actually volunteered at a Kiwanis event, so a boys and girls club event when I was a kid, um, and I dressed up as an alien. I had the I actually got to do put some fake blood around the face, around the lips, so it looked like a like a not cannibalistic but a flesh eating alien with the with the traditional like Area 51 looking face. Um, the funniest thing out of that, I ended up having a conversation with a guy who dressed up like a vampire, and we had a conversation about Gangrel, the wrestler. Because it was still WWF at the time, Attitude Era was still going strong, Gangrel and the Brood, I think it was the new Brood by this time, so instead of Edge and Christian, it was Matt and Jeff Hardy. Uh, I forgot to move Gil down. Um, but it was still a good time, just as an alien, it was all good and everything. My most recent costume is, was a fan of the opera mask and just dressed up all nice and pretty. Which, oh, I gotta switch. But you know what, screw it, I'm faster. And I dressed up all cleaned up, taut suit and tie, and then I just put on a Phantom of the Opera mask type of uh, deal. And I rocked it. The oh, hello, Tad. Ooh, absorb. But yeah, tell me about a, a Halloween story of yours and how that bases around your favorite costume. I missed uh, the second ice ball. All right, Lotad is down. Ring that bell. Phoebus. I gotta go for that body slam again. I hope I don't get a Phoebus, because of just the fact that I won't have high beauty on that Phoebus, so it won't evolve. And I don't know how to get a Phoebus to evolve without the high beauty in Gen 3. Ow. Alright, I might as well keep Gil up at the top, because he's less than 4 or 5... Well, he's one Pokemon away from evolving, so... Uh, not evolving, leveling up, sorry. Last alley with the Zigzagoon. Zigzagoon's adorable, but I'm gonna kill it now. Aw, oh, you got that flinch on me, you stupid thing? Headbutt did worse than Tackle did. Yeah, yeah, growl me. I gotta keep an eye on the timer, too, because I don't want to do super long episodes because I have to do training and stuff. But I don't know if I'm going to be packing the training montage under this one because this one is going to be a quick episode. We're just going to be going around, beating... At least we'll beat Nugget Bridge today, that's it. Okay, seal. Strict water, so let's just... Keep go for body slams. 
Yeah, whatever, ring the bell. Headbutt. Sorry, I gotta speed this up, because that shell bell is annoying me to no end. Barb What's with all the water types? Wow. There we go. Good Gil. Okay, now back to the Pokemon Center. First, I'm going to switch the... Actually, no. Yeah, I better do it this way. There. I'm actually getting, like, painful... Alright, number three. I won't be easy. Let's go, youngster. What's your face? Youngster Timmy. Timmy! It's electric against Rango. Let's do it. Let's do it to it. Yeah, yeah, how bark at the moon. There we go. Damn it. <laughs> I was hoping that wouldn't have happened. And then we get the hoot hoot. That's just the... Actually, no, I'm gonna... Because hoot hoot at level 14 will no hypnosis. Come to think of it. Now I get the stab back for scratch. Thank you, Hoot Hoot. All right. Mm. Yeah, I know my way takes longer, but I'm afraid of dying that much. Alright, number four, it's another lass with who's sticking out that ass. It would have been funny if Last Rally had a relicanth. Okay, let's hit the scratch. Get that stab. Almost killed Jigglypuff, but I lost the ability to scratch, which is okay. I got rolling kick for that. I'm running a very balanced Kecleon, come to think of it. Shlugma. Definitely not using a fighting attack, because I'm going to end up getting myself burned if it has flame body. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Alright, I can use Scratch again, but I'm not going to. Psybeam is doing enough. There we go. And then number five. I forgot to switch out Rango. Oops. I'll switch him out by the time I hit the hit the grunt. Camper Ethan with the Hound Door. Actually, it's a good thing I didn't switch Rango out. Hound Door uses Growl. My freaking chest is freaking painful right now and I don't know why. I go for that rolling kick. Come on rolling kick hit. It's going to be a one shot kill if you hit the rolling kick. There it goes. Goodbye Houndour. Not Houndour. Houndour. Whoa too much. Alright. Time to run back to the Pokemon Center. And the power that is Scorcher comes up back up to the top. That's congratulations! You beat our five content strainers. You just earned a fabulous prize. Nugget. It might not be a nugget, but it looks like it's still a nugget, which would be funny. No, I don't want to join. I'll play Pokemon Apollo next. Next game will be Pokemon Apollo. If I don't want to run an Egglock, because Egglocks are fun. Later and female. You must be joking. Oh, almost killed it. Another ember should do the trick. Who wants some roast Nidoran? Okay. Why not? Fuck no. Um. And I know I can't switch. 
Uh, let's start with the wing attack, see what happens. Get the stab wing attack off, almost. Ooh, no. Hmm. Let's see what I can use in the bag that'll... Can I use anything? Oh, I still got a nugget, that's funny. Um... Because Destiny's Bond is still active. Oh no, I'm trapped. I'm trapped. I gotta... I, oh no. No, this can't be happening. Please... Oh. Oh, well. Then there's nothing weak enough that'll leave Why Not alone unless Why Not uses Protect. <sighs> Salutation, Scorcher. Uh, <laughs> fucking why not? I hate you, why not? I hate you, 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 I hate you. Damn it. Mm. Oh, you suck. So freaking hard. Oh, my God. Chest wrenched open. Scorcher. Damn it all. If I, oh, if I had Sturdy ready, I would be fine. But I don't need to heal anyone because I'm still healthy. I'll just go to the Pokemart and buy some, I'm fine for Pokeballs. Buy some Super Potions. Thank you. Buy another potion. Thank you. Buy an extra couple paralysis heals. Buy an extra awakening. Buy some repels. We'll buy one repel. And then after selling the nugget, buy a bunch of repels. Move the super potion up to the top. Can't I do it? Okay, I can't do it yet. And now buy some extra repels. That's fine. Damn it all. Okay, now switching repels. There. Super potion. There. Awakening. Burn heal. Uh, oh yeah, males. Male at the cell. Uh, keep. Oh, might as well sell this for 50. Glitter mail, yeah. Retro mail, yeah. Keep the let's oh, hundred, hundred. I should probably slap the deep sea scale on someone. Oh God! Might as well slap it on Rango, cause Rango doesn't have an item to hold. God damn it! I miss you already, Scorcher. All right, let's catch Scorcher's replacement. Not complaining too much, cause they have. Kirby to take any fighting attack. Attack will do too. Alright. Uh, let's hit the yawn. Arm thrust will do one at a time, which is good. You might as well hold down. Use a potion. Get Kirby up to the top. Okay, you're asleep, so now let's throw that ball. Caught Hariyama. That's alright. Yeah, might as well. Since it's a female, I'm gonna name it Bertha. Because Bertha seems to be that trademark magic name. Oh my god. Let's see Bertha stuff. Please be adamant. Timid! Great! Arm thrust, focus, energy, sand attack, and tackle. The attack's already good. What is with my team and speed? Let's see, speed. 14, 18, 23, 25. Why is gulping faster than my whole team? Anyway. Let's heal up Bertha. I'm gonna have to raise her in a grind. I probably won't even do a grinding montage for Bertha because it'll just be quick stuff. Let's take on this guy. 
I am depressed and pissed right now. So let's finish off Camper Shane. I think I can catch one more Pokemon, so I'll do that. Let's sludge the Slugma. I almost killed it. No, you're not. No. Now burn me with flame body. That didn't happen. Spiel again. What is with all these Pokemon trainers having a spiel? Switch the Rango. It is depressing. Let's get that rolling kick off. Kill the spiel. Alright. Camper Shane beat. I got time for another captured Pokemon. Team Ooh. 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 Oh my god. Zap Cannon. I gotta see who can learn Zap Cannon. Z Rango, Kirby can learn, and Bert. Why? Why can a Hariyama learn Zap Cannon? I'll wait till I catch an electric type. Alright. Just gonna leave this guy alone. There's a berry over here. That's a sharp beak. Not bad, if I catch a flying type, I can slap this sharp beak on. So I just kind of stay in this range, because that's where the grass is. Alright. Not bad. Seedra, but I only have a, already have a water type. Don't have, well, po if it had poison point, it makes no difference, because Kirby can resist it. Yep, yep. Bubble. Ooh, that was close. And it lost speed. So let's slap the yawn on. Okay, Seedra can be faster. Okay, use the potion to kind of cheat my way for an extra turn. Smoke screen, that's fine, it won't make a difference. I'm going to try the Nest Ball on the Seedra. Actually, hold on. Let's check out what Nest Ball does on weaker Pokemon. What the hell? Let's see what happens. One, two, three. Click. Okay. Caught a Seedra, which is okay, I guess. It's no Scorcher. Body bristle with sharp spikes. Careless trying to touch it can cause fainting from the spikes, which is probably why it usually has poison point. But if it has sniper, oh my god. Let's see, it's female. Um, hmm. You know what? Let's just. Oni. Oh, or is there Oni. Let's check out Oni's stats. Lonely nature. Thank you. Poison point. Yep. Special attack. Look at you. Water gun and bubble. That's just good. Okay, so let's rush to the Pokemon Center. Call it game for now. Fuck. Now I'm back up to five Pokemon. Much good. That'll do me. There we go. So I already healed. Might as well heal again. Okay. So that's this episode. This episode was an episode. Ugh. Question of the day. What's your favorite costume? And tell you can tell me a story about your favorite Halloween costume. I am depressed as hell, but let's get that like up. Let's get that like bar up to 15. This is Master Mewtwo. Have you slammed that like button? 
Side strike that subscribe button and feel free to comment with your outrage to this god damn freaking what was it that killed Scorcher? Why not? Why not? Because it's horrible, it's mean, and all that other stuff.